All right, I'm preparing fur to wrap around his uh, staff. The story is changing on this piece as I work on it and as I do some research. So I'll be right back. Time to play with some play. So now I'm wrapping the uh, society staff with this uh, clay that I've cut and formed into fur. It's just a very tedious job of wrapping and making it look like fur. All right, what he's, uh, I've just changed the position of the uh, staff, and uh, it's a war party leader's staff. He's an assistant war party leader, and uh, is wrapped in otter skin, which that is supposed to be representative. But I'm gonna have him with, whoop, gotta get that anchored in there. I'm going to have him with a war club in his hand. And uh, as far as why he's in the position he is, about him being knocked down or maybe knocked off his horse or whatever. But uh, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. Like I said, this is all formulating as I'm working on it. And uh, I get, definitely got to work on his head and his face. That's uh, not working right now. But that'll come later. All right. I might put this knee more down on the ground. Like he's just kind of bringing himself back upright, but still threatening with a, a war club. All right, be right back. All right, as sometimes happens, you think you've got a great idea, but the more you work it, the more you realize that the story's going nowhere. I'm gonna put this aside. I, uh, I just see it not getting there. It happens. We come up with an idea in our dreams and uh, we wake up at night thinking about it and we think about it for a couple of days. But I just don't see this one working at all. I can't think of a, a good story to go with it. And the story I do think of, I can't, it, you can't self-explain it. Uh, you have to have things going on around it. And uh, it just, you know, without having a horse laying dead behind him or something like that, you, it, it doesn't really explain what he's doing. And a lot of galleries are really good at selling artwork, but they're not very good at telling the story that goes with the piece. Uh, and that's not their fault. I mean, they've got a lot of artwork that they got to uh, sell, and they got to remember all the stories of all of them. I can't expect that. All right, I'm going to set this aside. I've got several clays that uh, I've got to get ready for the NFR rodeo uh, show that they're gonna, my representative is gonna take uh, several clays down to. And uh, 
I'll set this aside. I won't tear it up. Uh, I'll let it sit for a while. And maybe I'll come back at it at some point in the future. I know it might be disappointing for you to have to see the thing completed. But uh, this is part of the process of sculpting. Uh, you have an idea, but as you're working on it, it doesn't seem to be working. And uh, you just have to move on. Uh, you can't uh, work yourself into the ground, so to speak. I'm not defeated, <laughs> like the title of the piece. But anyway, I'll uh, see you guys next time. I'll be working on several plays to finish them up, to get them to a point where they could be cast up tomorrow. Um, so that when we show them in that show down there at the uh, rodeo in Las Vegas, uh, that uh, they'll be far enough along that when we take an order, we can bring it back and get them started right away being cast up. So that's going to be it for today. I'm sorry it's not much better than this, but um, this is part of being an artist. Some things work, some things don't. And this one didn't work. Good night, everybody. Have a great night. And when you feel like something's not working, don't feel alone. We all have that feeling. Good night. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. It really would help me. Also, check out the link below this video. It will take you to a review of my nine instructional videos that could be very helpful to you if you're thinking of sculpting. Good night, everybody.